Probability of Combined Events KSSM Mathematics Form 4 Mutually Exclusive Events and Non-Mutually Exclusive Events Self-Practice 9.3a Page 254 to 255 Question number 1 A fair dice is rolled A list of events is given as follows P is the event of getting a number that is greater than 4 Q is the event of getting an even number R is the event of getting a perfect square Determine whether the following pairs of events are mutually exclusive events or non-mutually exclusive events A. P and Q A fair dice is rolled means that the universal set is 1 to 6 and set P is 5 and 6 set Q is 2, 4, 6 and finally set R is 4 P and Q P intersect Q is P intersect Q the common element is 6 so the number of elements of P intersect Q is 1 so P and Q are non-mutually exclusive events B P and R P intersect R P intersect R there are no common elements so, P intersect R is empty set. So, the number of elements of P intersect R is 0. So, they are mutually exclusive events. Q and R. Q intersect R is Q intersect R. The common element is 4. So, the number of elements for Q intersect R is 1. So, they are non mutually exclusive events. Question number 2. An egg is chosen at random from a farm. K is the event of selecting a correct egg. L is the event of selecting a grade A egg. M is the event of selecting a grade C egg. Determine whether the following pairs of events are mutually exclusive events or non mutually exclusive events. A. K and L. K. A correct egg can be a grade A egg. So K and L are non mutually exclusive events. B K and M K a crack eight can be a grade C egg. So K and M are non mutually exclusive events. C L and M a grade A egg cannot be a great C A. So L and M are mutually exclusive events. Question number three. A tourist is selected randomly at Kuala Lumpur International Airport. R is the event of selecting a tourist from an European country. S is the event of selecting a tourist from an Asian country. P is the event of selecting a tourist from a Commonwealth country. Determine whether the following pairs of events are mutually exclusive events or non mutually exclusive events. A. R and S. A tourist from a European country cannot be a tourist from an Asian country. So R and S are mutually exclusive events. B. R and T. A tourist from a European country can be a tourist from a commonwealth country. So R and T are non mutually exclusive events. C S and T. A tourist from an Asian country can be a tourist from a commonwealth country. So S and T are non mutually exclusive events. If you have any questions, please leave your comments. Thank you very much.